When Tiepolo came to Würzburg in 1750, the town already had a population of 15,000, and the Marienberg fortress, the old Mainbrücke, the city hall, the houses of the common craftspeople, the Prince Bishop's Castle for the summer month in Veitsöchheim and the Marienkapelle already existed. Tiepolo had been invited by Philip von Greifenklau at that time Prince Bishop in order to design the dining hall and the staircase of his town residence. The Prince Bishop was very keen on Tiepolo's work who was not only in Italy known for his fresco painting. With his newly built residence, he wanted to create a reception place for the rich and powerful of his days and the premises should be accordingly impressive. He already had a fortress for defending himself and a castle for the summer month in Veitsöchheim at the gates of Würzburg was also his own. There strolled Philip von Greifenklau. Tiepolo wasn't cheap, of course. For his work, he received 40,000 gulden, but the Prince Bishop was well off. His predecessors had already let their subjects work for their prosperity and luxury, a fact which those didn't always accept without complaint. Anyway, Cipolo fulfilled with his work all claims that were made to him. The Prince Bishop was delighted. With a fresco in the staircase of the residence, the Italian had created the largest fresco ceiling in the world and hence immortalized himself his employer von Greifenklau and the builder of the residence, Balthasar Neumann. His work survived all wars and pleases us and our guests till today.